Stephen Comley is the first Rowley resident to ever run for president. In this exclusive interview with VTV, Mr. Comley talked about his run for presidency and how students could get involved in politics. So tell me a little bit about yourself. I understand you had a background in farming. I was in business when I was 13 years old. I was raising uh, blue hybrid squash, 160 ton of it. And uh, my dad, he asked me, he says, do you want to work by the hour or you want to go into business with me? And I decided to go into business with him. So that was really my first experience being in business. So how did you get involved in politics? Well, I was never involved with politics, but um, I got involved with uh, trying to get our electric leaders to uh, represent us the way that they should. My family's been in the nursing home profession for over 80 years. Uh, one of the nurses called me at my office and she says, you gotta come down and see Jean right away. And I said, what's wrong? She said, well, she's almost in tears. She said, Mr. Conley, you know I'm paralyzed. And I said, of course I know. We've been taking care of you for a number of years, Jean. She says, if the Seabrook plant has a meltdown, which is only 10 miles from your nursing home, what's the evacuation plan for me? And I said, I don't know, Jean, but I'll go find out. So I went over the plant and I asked them. And they said, we don't have an evacuation for her. And I said, well, you can't open the plant then until you got an evacuation for everybody. And they snickered at me. And they said, you gotta go see the Nuclear Regulatory Commission. And I said, who are they? Oh, they make sure all the plants are safe. And I said, well, it sounds like they haven't been by here lately. My college professors always encouraged me in college to stand up for what I believe in when I know something's wrong. And I know something's wrong here. When the Nuclear Regulatory Commission, a federal government agency, is not protecting the people, then the people are going to stand up and protect themselves. So that's how it all started. So out of all the issues presented on your platform, nuclear energy is at the top. Why is that? It threatens every other issue. And we can't afford a Chernobyl-like accident or, or a Fukushima accident in the United States. So why do you think teens should get involved in the political process? because it's your future. It's more your future than mine. And you have a responsibility to do that. This woman died <laughs> knowing the high offic highest officials in the United States felt she was expendable to keep the profits of the industry alive. And everybody could have their grandmother or grandfather in my son's nursing home. How far is the industry and politicians willing to go in Washington to keep this industry alive. There's counterfeit substandard parts in most of the nuclear plants in the United States. Counterfeit substandard parts in nuclear plants in the United States. I'm not surprised to hear that. Why, am I surprised? So, you brought a petition with you today. What is that about, and how can Triton students get involved? Read the petition. If you agree with the petition, then you circulate it through the whole school. And uh, that you're gonna stand up for what you believe in. And when our elected officials aren't aren't uh, protecting us like they should, then you're going to get involved. All right. Thank you so much. It's been yep. really nice. Thank you. In running for president, Mr. Comley is taking a stand for things he believes in and encourages students to do the same.